Hey folks, uh, just thought I'd bring another tool haul here. Uh, we'll get right into it. So to start up, I got some snap-on punches. Here is the part number right there. KB2177. Uh, they're long tapered ones. I think they're great. They're awesome for like suspension work and whatnot or knocking out bolts at a distance or anything like that. Um, they're pretty They're pretty spendy, I'll be honest with you. Um, but it's their main main USA and I really like them. So, but yeah, that's, they're pretty cool little, little three piece set here. I shouldn't say little, pretty big, but super nice, high quality. So there's that comes in a nice little pouch. Next up following the old punch line here, I got these, but they're not Mac. So it turns out I, for once in my life, I finally bought something off eBay for tools and, uh, I thought I got a good deal on these. They were supposed to be all Mac ones and they're roll pin punches, except for like two of them. Two of them are like round off pretty bad, but I was like, oh, whatever. I'll just get it warranted through Mac. No big deal. Turns out they're all, let me see if it'll focus. Uh, of course there's one. Anyways, these are all Mayhew. Um, so that kind of sucks. I don't know if Mayhew on these has a lifetime warranty. I'm guessing not. Um, but I'll have to do some more digging into it. It'd be nice if it did. Uh, so always be... I From the pictures the guy had posted, you couldn't really tell anyway. So it wasn't really... It, it, it is what it is. Um, I was fortunate enough. I got a hold of the seller. was going to return them. And he's like, you know what? Just I'll just send you your money back. You just keep them. That works out just fine. So that was super super cool of him and i'm glad that i you know he was he was an awesome seller in that re aspect of it and just he gave my money back and just said just screw it just keep them so they uh i guess i'll be keeping these in the collection but if anybody knows that these mayhew uh roll pins are um warranty let me know so i can get that taken care of otherwise i'll have to do some digging but yeah moving next i got some pink snap-on mini screwdrivers uh, I was needing a set of small ones, and my dealer had these on sale for a little bit, and I figured pink. Nobody else got pink. Why not? You know, I'll take a few dollars off of pink. I don't care. Plus, they're kind of they're they're pretty cool. They're not noticeable, so that's a good color. Next up, I got something that I haven't really seen a whole lot on YouTube. It's a UV streamlight. There's not, I, I, at this time, anyways, recording this, I haven't seen too many, like, reviews or anything in these, and I was wanting UV light, and I was going to go with the snap-on one, and I thought, you know what, let me just try this one, it's, I got it for 50 bucks, so, we'll see, it's rechargeable, so that's pretty nice, um, but yeah, I got, I got a use for it coming up here on my, actually, one of my personal vehicles, so hopefully I'll be making a video once I get around to working on it and checking for an oil leak I have going on. And I'll uh, make some kind of video and show you guys how well it works. So, yeah. Next up, not that I haven't bought plenty of these, but another Cyclops light. I lost my maroon one I bought a few months ago somehow. And so I want another one of these for at home. Uh, they're pretty cheap and I like them. They've held up pretty good for me. So, next up, actually, is this cool kit here from Maco? It's the electronic micro torch kit. I think uh, it's a rebrand. I like the power probe kit, but these are almost the same price. This is a couple dollars more. And I guess I just want to support my, my Mac guy. He's pretty cool. So I was happy to do that, but I, I really just wanted this. So I have a snap on torch, but the snap on one's really big. And I like the, um, like the, the tips and stuff you can add onto this to get into tighter areas. Uh, nothing's wrong with my snap on one. It works just fine. But I just wanted to try this one out. So, and it, it comes with a cool little case. So it's kind of nice. All your all your bits and accessories. Where's the part number on that? There it is. There's that. By the way, for that UV light, I just don't see one on there. Yeah. And then, uh, oh, we got a few more things here. We'll go with uh, a couple of my favorites that I was excited about getting is we'll start off with these so these crimpers 
I actually recently, I have a, like a full size, I had a full size kind of like this, well, just the snap on crimpers. They weren't wire strippers. And I managed to lose them one day at work. So that kind of sucks. So I had to buy new ones and I figured I'd give these ones a try just for doing, you know, buck connectors and whatnot. Uh, this one's obviously multi-use, so that's kind of nice. But we'll give those a try. And then these, so I had the, I think they're 47 ACFs or 46s. I can't remember. They're not the very small ones, but like the mid-range size of these. And I absolutely love them to like, they're, it's just, they're just awesome. They grip so well. They're high quality and I love them so much. So I, I finally got around to buying the big pair. I need to buy the little pair and he didn't have, I was just going to buy like the whole kit of them and they, he didn't have any on the truck at the time. So I just bought this for now and then going to order up a, the really small one here coming soon. Next up, I got this shout out to Mr. Subaru for, this is where I got this idea from and I got it from a snap on guy, but it's an easy ride long as you can see locking which i really think is cool um reversible you can do either hex drive or quarter inch down here super nice um lifetime warranty on it and yeah you can get these on amazon and stuff i just figured uh why not get it from snap on guy when i was there but yeah these it seems super nice haven't used it yet obviously so i can't really speak on how good a quality it is i do have an easy red three quarter inch ratchet that i like so hopefully this is just as good I'll try and get it to get little clicks here not bad it getting a really tight spaces so i'm looking forward to that um this one actually the part number is right here 4s12l and that's that Next up, Snap-on guy as well, got this, quarter inch brushless electric ratchet. Um, so I went on his truck actually, most of the stuff I buy over a time, it's not like I went on and bought this all at once. But um, this I went on there, I was just going to buy a, like a cheap, cheap used one he had and it was going to be fine for me because I don't use quarter inch all the time as far as electric ratchets go. Um, but he had happened to have uh, a guy like a week prior bought this and then he, my dealer got a blue one in stock and the guy traded this one back in and got the blue one. So my dealer gave me a sweet deal on this plus then threw in a battery. It was, he was shot off to him for that one. It was probably the best deal I've had in quite a while. Um, can't remember exactly what I paid for it, but I'm sure I could look it up in receipts. But yeah, it was it was a good deal. So I'm glad I got it and I've used it a few times and I love it so far. I'm, I'm trying to debate right now um if i'm gonna get the long neck in the snap-on quarter inch or if i'm gonna go with the new milwaukee one um i've always like usually with my power tools i'm a milwaukee guy other than i love the snap-on ratchets electric ratchets but i don't i see with milwaukee's new high speed one i don't really know which one to go with yet so i'm just kind of teetering which side i like more but yeah so next up I got this from my Mako guy, which would have saved me uh, quite a bit of hassle over the summer working on a uh, project. And it is not quite a bit like it's the end of the world, but it, it would have saved me for sure. Time and guesswork. A relay tester. So relay buddy, 1224, just hook her up to a battery, test your relay. Um, part number RB192. Pretty sweet. Uh, looking forward to using it. I'm glad I'll, I'll just be able to just, uh, pop a relay in, no messing around, and see if it's good or not, if it holds a load. So, and that's that's what I like about it, is it tests for load. And not. But, yeah, so we'll toss that off. And then, finally, last, last item here on this overly priced expensive little bundle here is a six-pound sledge. I got, it's like a, I don't know how long it is. I think it's like 16 inches or something like that. Maybe a little bit longer. I can't remember. Six pound sledge. Here's part number. Oh, focus. There you go for you guys. Um, I like this thing a lot. 
unfortunately th this is due to my doings not the not like the paints falling off or anything like that but yeah i like to sing a lot uh my i one time my coworker had a i use it an eight pound sledge same size just eight pounds and it was pretty nice and i figured you know what i'm gonna try the six pound and we'll see where that gets me um i like it so far it's been pretty nice but yeah um that's basically it guys other than uh i guess i don't know if you really want to include this i picked up this jbl flip six so i had the flip oh man what is it the uh, three or four i think i can't remember and it finally gave out on me and i've been using it for years so i went and bought a six been using it quite a bit actually and i really like this i love these little ones there they're great. I just figured I'd throw it in because I use it, you know, when you're wrenching, you got to have a little music playing, so why not? But, yeah, that's uh, that's everything. You guys got any questions about anything? Any You want me to give any feedback on anything once I get some more excuse or use on them? I will. Um, I'm trying to do when I do, when I get into doing more review stuff, I don't really want to just necessarily sit here and just, yeah, these are great, these are great, these are great, and just stare at it. I'd rather have a little video too of me like showing it in use type deal so you guys can actually get a, a feel of like oh that is that would be useful in that scenario or this and that i so but yeah thanks for checking it out guys hope you appreciate it i'll catch you in the next one peace